Hello, Silico friends, and welcome to the expert puzzle from LPEs for today. Today being the 31st of March, 2024. And we will get started right away with, I think, a two for this square because of these twos blocking across. We will now have a two here or here because this two blocks here giving me a two for one of these three squares. We also have a four for one of these three squares because of this four blocks down. And we're going to have a three and a six in two of these three positions. A six must go here or here because we have a six blocking up six blocking across, one of these must be a six blocking across. So yes, six here or here. A couple of sevens block here. Here's an easy seven. Three, seven, nine here, seven and three, four, a nine to go here. Three, six, seven, eight here. Three, six, this is a seven, eight. Two and four here. Five and eight block here. So five and eight must go here and here, and these therefore must be a two and a four. This goes to four blocks up. These two fours block here. This four blocks here, giving me a four here. So a five and an eight here, what to do about the two, seven and the nine we also need for the column, two and nine block here and the five blocks. So this is a seven or an eight, isn't it? So a two must go here, here, right? Uh, no, uh, no big help. So, it seems as if uh, these two squares must be a one and a nine. And here's how I figure that. We got a one and a nine blocking here. We got a one and a nine blocking here. We got a one and a nine blocking here. So these two squares must be a one and a nine. These are three, seven. So two, four, five, eight for the rest. Nice background knowledge, but not particularly helpful yet. I want to zoom in on this square here because it is very restricted. This is how it is restricted. These are one and nine. These are seven, three. Now look at what's available for this square. We know that these are four and two, so this can't be a one and it cannot be a two. It cannot be a three because a three goes here or here. Cannot be a four because a four goes here or here. It could be a five, but it cannot be a six, nor can it be a seven, eight, or a nine. So five goes here. Therefore, we have a five here and a two, four, and an eight here. Three, six, eight here. Remember that these must be a two and a four. Now let's have a look at this square. It's also quite restricted. It could be a one, but not a two because one of these is a two and not a three, not a four, not a five, not a six, not a seven, not an eight and not a nine. Here's a one. Two, four, three, six, seven for these squares. Three goes here, here. Six here or here, seven, don't really know. So a two now goes here or here. Again, sorry about that, Julian, but here's uh, another count. Look at this square. It must be a five because it can't be a one. And it cannot be a two because a two goes here or here, nor can it be a three or a four. It could be a five, let's input it now. Because it cannot be a six, seven, eight, or nine either. 
Remember these five and eight? Five now must go here and the eight here. Eight blocks across and across. One of these is an eight blocking up. Eight goes here. Three and six for these squares. Six blocks over. Three here, six here. Threes block over and up a three here. Now we're going to have threes here or here and here or here. These uh, are two and four. Therefore, it follows that this is a two or a four, which is now being blocked by this two, giving me a four here, two here, and a four here. This four forces a two to go here, and the four goes here. One and nine here still. We've got a couple of eights blocking here and here and across here, and therefore we have an eight here. Three, six, seven here. We knew that. Three, seven, and a six here, here, and a six here and here. Yes, we, we knew that. A six, seven, and a three. We got a three and a seven blocking here, so this is a six. And this six blocks down, this six blocks up, this six blocks across. We have ourselves a six here. Here, a seven and a three. Easy. The three blocks up, seven here, three here, seven here. Seven blocks over and seven blocks up and seven here. Seven blocks down and down and across. Seven, therefore, here. Two sevens blocking across, seven blocks down, seven blocks down, seven here. Two six and nine here, two nine blocks down. Here's a six, therefore we have a six here from memory and a two and a nine here. Two blocks down, nine here, two here, and therefore we have ourselves a nine here. This one forces a one to go here, and this must be a three, like so. So where are we at now? Anything that we can do that makes sense? Yes, a couple of threes block here and here. So this is a three, and these are eight and nine. This, therefore, are one and a five. And since this one blocks here, this one blocks here, and this one blocks here. We know that this must be a one. Now, that makes this a nine and this a one, doesn't it? Five, eight, nine here. Five blocks here, five blocks here. Five must go here, eight and nine here. Nine blocks here, this is an eight, this is a nine. This is an eight. Two, four, eight here still. Two and four forces an eight to go here. Two and four here. Four blocks down, four blocks over, four here, here. But this one should be doable. <laughs> it must be a nine. <laughs> and a one, two, and a four here. Let's do this one first. This is a five. And here a two and a nine. The nine blocks up. Here's a two. Here's a nine. Two blocks down. We have ourselves a two here. And now a one and a four here. Easy. One blocks over. Four here. One here. Now we have a four here. And we have a two here. A one and a five for these two squares, the five blocks up, one here, five here, and that's it. Thank you for watching, and see you back here again tomorrow, I hope. Bye for now.